Students and stylists from the O'Brien Aveda Institute will showcase their creativity and technical skills, all for a great cause. I'm very excited to Not learn more about for this. Fun. Yeah, it's awesome too. Spencer Thomas is live this morning in Wilson. She has more. Hey, Hi, Spencer. Spencer. Hi, good morning everyone. Yes, we are here in Williston at the O'Brien Aveda Institute. I'm standing here with a very special someone. This is Stacy Savage, the technical director here. We're talking all about a very, very important event that kicks off tonight. So Stacy, what is that event? Tonight is our annual Catwalk yes. for Water. It's a huge fashion show that our students put on. We are super, super proud of them. Um, it's being held at Echo, mm -hmm. and the students have worked for weeks and weeks and weeks on these outfits, so right. it's super, super exciting. This is like the unveiling for them. Um, all of the materials that they're using are all recycled materials. That's my favorite part. Isn't so what cool? kind of materials? Are oh we talking gosh. like newspaper, paper plates, all you, of the above? All of the above, okay. and then some corks, um, paper corks. plates. Uh, used bags. Um, Gee, so they have to have material. a lot of creative juices running through their there heads. Has been, I have to say, I'm really impressed with yeah. some of the stuff that they've pulled out and, and put together. Um, of course, all of the used materials that we recycle here in the right. salon, um, they're using a lot of that stuff as well. So you'll How see cool. some like color tubes and Foils? Um, caps. There might even be some foil stuff ah. being reused. I'm not sure about the foils, but okay. there are some pretty cool things. And What's, what always blows my mind is what they make of it. Right. You know, they come up with something, and I look in the different rooms that we have with all the materials spread out, mm -hmm. and it's like little by little, every time they work on them, it comes together and it right. starts to become something. Right. So that's the really exciting part. And I think it's exciting for the students, too, to realize that you don't always have to go buy something brand new oh, to absolutely. make it amazing. Absolutely. So that's one part of it. And then there's the other part of it where they're doing the hair and the makeup, because we are right. a cosmetology school. So exactly. we also have... I mean, we have barbering and aesthetics, so there will be some guys working on some stuff. The estheticians will be working on some stuff. Okay. Um, so they, they have to create the entire look, not just the outfit, but the hair and the makeup and everything involved. Right, and so today, early this morning, those women are going to be coming in here, women yes. and men, yes. are going to be coming in here and they're going yep. to be putting their skills to the test, creating those funky hairstyles and crazy makeup to make those outfits really shine on Exactly, the stage. those are like the icing on the cake because yeah. the, the, the outfits they've been working on for weeks. Uh -huh. So today's the day where they put it all together. Today's the day they do the majority of the hair work. They might have done some prep work ahead of time, Okay. Um, but they'll be doing the makeup. So today is an all day, all hands on deck. Wow. Um, today's fun. It's really about fun and putting it all together and, and seeing all their work yeah. you know, kind of come together. Absolutely. Um, the best part about all of this, I mean, we're talking about all these really cool things, mm -hmm. right? But the reality is this is a fundraiser. Right. And it's all about Earth Month and clean water. Right. So and something that you guys use on a day-to-day -day basis, water. Right. Okay. Right. A hairstylist, you need water. Right. You know? um, so we're always giving back, and it's part of Aveda's mission and part of our mission as well to always give back to both locally and globally. Right. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Locally, all of our monies raised go to the Lake Champlain Committee. So everything that we raise here tonight goes right back into the community. Right here. It yeah. stays right here. Exactly. And that's the best part about yeah, it. Absolutely. I love that. And I'm so excited to talk a little bit more because there is so much more about this event, you guys. You have to stay with us. We're going to be here with Stacy and yeah. climbing into our 8 o'clock hour. Those students are going to be piling in. And we might show you guys some of the things they are working on. So again, stay with us. But for now, we're live here in Williston. Spencer Thomas. Back to you guys at the studio.